another system so based on my experience based on my earlier experience as i can see lot of projects in my career so this point i will be arranging into three points okay so regarding this point also you can check any uh, trainer in youtube so one every trainer every trainer will say different things but that is absolutely uh, not good at all as per my working experience i can see the lot of projects in my experience so basically this one i will classified into three points the first point is how we will move our changes from one system to another system the first classification is for example your client or your project is using solution manager and the second point is other ticketing tools like the service now remedy force or aws or whatever the zira or whatever it is with the combination of solution manager okay and the third point is other ticketing tools it means in this case there is no solution manager ticketing tool like service now remedy force aws here your client is using only this ticketing tools he is not using solution manager so like these three scenarios we are uh, no like how we will move our changes from one system to another system so from these two points especially your client is using the solution manager so these things and all taken care by the charm team c h a r m charm team or solution manager team solman team okay so these two cases and where it comes to the third case the third case this activities and all performed by the basis team which team basis team okay so here there is no basis team charm team charm team or solman team or solution manager team why because here we are using the solution manager ticketing tool solution manager ticketing tool is one and only ticketing tool owned by the sap already i told you so many times earlier so in sap we have only one ticketing tool that is the solution manager ticketing tool and this ticketing tool is directly integrating with our sap application and here we have the system logins and here you can see the logins and uh, here you can see the systems right so within the help of this sap logon also we are opening our solution manager ticketing tools but that is not working in dummy or in educational systems but where it comes to the real time systems we can log in into our solution manager ticketing tool with the help of sap system also okay the first point is very clear so the next and where it comes to this case the basis team comes into picture to move our changes from one system to another system and again here we have different cases so each and every point i will try to explain here so the first point i will go to the first point so is it possible to copy my data no so how we will move anyone have feel bored or interesting no comments ha huh? another and breakfast problem ha huh? okay next so here the first point is solution manager okay let's say for example your client is using solution manager ticketing tool so in this case the first of all here in solution manager we have a different uh, tabs different tabs in practical sessions i will show you no problem but in this online session i will tell you only uh, with the help of these things only 
I will not show you my real time system, but when it comes to uh, the practical sessions. So at the time of practical sessions, I will show you these are all things with my system. OK, so here there is a one transport. Management tab. OK, so within this transport management tab, we need to take the transport from here. Transport request. Please try to understand this point is very, very important. So in transport management tab, we need to go to select the transport request option. And here when you select this one again, the system is uh, showing you you want customizing request or do you want the workbench request? So there is one screen and within that we need to select that one also. Uh, otherwise, give me two minutes. I will cross check with my other material. OK, I will stop my sharing. I will try to show you those uh, things also directly. So. Okay, so no problem. I will show you that points also. So please try to concentrate today class. It's very, very important. OK, so now you are able to see my screen, right? Please sir. confirm. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. So here you can see this is my solution manager ticketing tool. OK, so in this solution manager ticketing tool, here you can see there is a tabs. Regarding this ticketing tool also in our upcoming sessions, we have three to four days of classes. So at that time I will tell you very clearly pin to pin each and every tab. But now whatever the required thing we need to understand in system landscape point of view, those points only I will try to cover in this session. OK, so now here you can see in solution manager and even regarding this topic also we have the practical class. So within that practical class is completely offline session. So within that offline session, I will show you directly in front of you how I will move my changes from development to quality system also. But in this online session, I will try to explain with the help of screenshots only. Please try to understand. So now here you can see there is a transport management tab and here there is a transport request option. What I will try to say here and what I will try to explain here. For example, you are working in any one project in SAP, either it is implementation or support project. You need to make some configurations and your client is using solution manager ticketing tool. At that time, you need to go to your solution manager ticketing tool and you need to open your the task or open your CD change document or open your incident and within that incident there is a transport management tab 
and this transport request is automatically connecting to your incident okay so when you go to the transport management tab here there is a transport request option so once you go into edit option and once you click here the transport request option the system will open one more pop up like this and in this pop up your incident and your system and your client is automatically showed by the system why because already i told you solution manager ticketing tool is the internal or is the own ticketing tool by the sap it is directly connecting to the sap system so now here you can see already i told you how many types of transport requests we have workbench request and customizing request so here you need to select for this incident do you want this one or this one or both sometimes what happen especially for some incidents or from so some cds in implementation project we need these two things also so at that time you need to tick mark these two and click on okay so in below we have done option or if you want to only customizing you need to remove this option or if you want to only workbench request you need to remove this tick mark option so once you click okay the system is automatically given you one tr here okay so this tr as per your system landscape whatever i showed you here as per your system landscape either it is e01 or d01 so usually it is e01 simply the system starts with the tr number with e01 you can find it here itself also so later you need to go to your e01 system and within that e01 system okay so you will start your configuration and you will save your changes into this tr is it clear how you will take the tr and how you will save your changes okay so once you captured your changes once you captured your changes now you want to move your changes from development to quality system so now this time uh, as per my experience earlier we have these are all access also in my earlier project so first of all you need to release this sub task already i showed you earlier just you can select this one and click this release directly then this sub task is released here this is the first step and the second step will be again you need to go to this transport request tab you need to select this one the tr and you need to perform this transport of copies option it means you need to select this transport of copies option once you select this transport copies option okay so the system again it is asking save after 2 minutes or after 5 minutes okay before you are moving your changes here you can see you can find out that status in import status also before you are moving your changes to quality system the import status in gray color and once you once your changes is moved from development to quality the import status will be green color okay so by showing this by show this by see this uh, uh, import status in green color you can check your configuration in quality system also automatically your changes moved to development to quality system this point i will explain with the help of solution manager ticketing tool and this point how we will move your changes from one system to another system the first point is very clear your client is using solution manager ticketing tool now you will open that incident in solman and now you will go to the transport management tab you need to select the transport request and within that you need to choose which request you want customizing or workbench and later you need to capture your changes as per the system development system 
and later you can come back here and you need to select here and click on transport of copies and you can find out that status and these are all done